Hello everyone, welcome to this edition of Cooking with Talisha's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make um, meatloaf. Very simple, easy recipe. I'm going to show you what all I need. I mean what all you need, so what all I need. Um, you need a cup of milk. I got my different seasons. I'll show y'all those. One pack of um, the onion soup mix. Two packs of meatloaf mix. And you could probably get one of these you can use ground beef you can use turkey whatever that you want to use how much is this this is a um, five pound i'm making a big one so it's i'm doubling the size cream of chicken cream of mushroom worcester sour sauce ketchup mustard you need one diced onion and one diced pepper all right, I'm going to get to this and show you how this come all together. It's real simple. Okay, so you'll put your um your meat in a bowl or, you know, whatever makes a bowl. Go ahead and add your onions, chopped up onions and chopped up bell peppers. Oh, and I didn't tell you on a, um, you need eggs too and um, breadcrumbs. So go ahead and put your pack of meatloaf seasoning, your onion soup mix, that didn't go too well, that fell, onion soup mix, I'm going to add um, four eggs, if you're using one of these, I would just um, suggest using three eggs. Hold on. I'm just going to use a half of, um, half a can of cream of mushroom and cream of onion. and a half a cup of milk. We ain't gonna pour that in there yet. Now let's go ahead and mix all these ingredients together. Make sure you mix this in all good. Go ahead, add your half a cup of milk. I'm gonna put the breadcrumbs in there last. Go ahead and, because the bread comes is what's going to make it like stick and hold together. I'll say add about a cup of bread crumbs. Then you also want to add in some mustard and ketchup. I know that sounds weird and funny. I also use this for the, for the sauce at the top, but you will see. I'm going to clean this off. Also add a little Worcestershire sauce. Now go ahead and mix all this in there. And if it's still like too, too wet, just add some more bread crumbs. You don't want it all the way wet. Y'all know what? I was doing too much. I forgot to add the seasoning. See? Cooks have problems. So I add black pepper. We make mistakes too. Garlic powder, onion powder, Mrs. Dash, and seasoning salt, and some orange Goya packets. Go ahead and mix this together. Okay, here's your pan. All right, since I didn't clean this earlier. Now you're just gonna make a loaf. Go ahead and dump this in there. And just 
See? Just make it look like a loaf. I'm going to flatten mine out a little bit because I want to make long pieces. Just add a little water along the edge. And I sprinkle a little Mrs. Dash in, in there on top of it. You can never have enough seasonings. Go ahead and put this in the pre-eating oven on 375 degrees until, I like my ground beef all the way done, so I'll say about um, an hour, but we'll come back and check on it. Okay, this is the finish. I poured the excess juice off of it. Now we're gonna make the top part for the sauce that go on the top. Ketchup, mustard, A1 sauce. And ketchup, mustard, egg, and sauce. So we're gonna put about a cup of um, ketchup. Just a Two or three tablespoons of mustard. And just a tablespoon of A1 sauce. Give it like that tangy. All we're gonna do is just mix this together. Now we're just gonna, I pull mass down the middle and then go to the side. Some people use um, tomato paste. You can use tomato paste. It don't matter. You just want to make sure this is all mixed on the top of this. Just put this back in the oven for 15 minutes and when we come back I will show you the final product of Okay you guys to go to finishing product I already got cut it look how that looks in the inside make sure you like subscribe and share let me know how you do your meatloaf and you know you can serve them over egg noodles and, and I have this over garlic mashed potatoes when I say this it's so good such an easy recipe let me know how you do your meatloaf and if you try mine let me know how you like it thank you for watching this episode we're cooking with talisha's kitchen with meatloaf everybody have a blessed and wonderful day